taking their belongings, moving them, moving the people to a concentrated area. I asked the governor's office for help on multiple occasions by providing additional services and money towards housing. This is not helpful. Passionate words from Councilmember Leslie Harris speaking about dozens of homeless people having their encampment dismantled due to orders from Governor Jeff Landry. Yesterday we did a press conference asking them not to sweep this area and the reason why we asked for that not to move is we have 164 applications between here and the French Quarter for persons for permanent supportive housing. City leaders say they already had plans to dismantle the encampment around Thanksgiving that once set under the bridge near Calliope in downtown New Orleans. Now they fear it could be difficult to find some of the people who've been dispersed, and this could cause a bigger issue for the city. Which now means that we're going to have other encampments pop up all throughout the city of New Orleans. According to city leaders, they were originally told the sweep would happen Thursday, but instead multiple agencies were out Wednesday morning relocating the homeless. There were about 75 people living under the bridge on Calliope Street, and there are more than 100 homeless people living in the French Quarter. The governor's office says it's committed to ensuring New Orleans puts its best foot forward when on the world stage for Taylor Swift concert and the Super Bowl. However, city leaders believe it was a better way this issue could have been handled. Please help us. This right here isn't helping us. This is us setting up our city to look good for the rest of the world. But what about the citizens who are here? What's your message to Governor Jeff Landry? Do better. Think about people. Put people first. And you got to do better. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.